Hi and welcome to Spice and Pans. Today we'll be cooking hawker style fish soup. So let's start cooking. We have now prepared the ingredients for the stock. I have with me over here 500 grams of chicken feet. I've already washed them. We need to blanch them first in a pot of water, room temperature water. Add the chicken feet in. I've not on the fire yet. I'll explain to you why is this so in a while. Turn on the flame now. Using medium heat, we'll boil this for about 10 minutes or so. Now the reason why I'm not putting in the chicken feet in boiling water is because if you were to put this directly into hot water, it will contract immediately and the scum as well as the blood will not be released. We want to slowly release all the blood so that you have a very clear stock. So I'll let this boil for 10 minutes and I'll see you back in a while. I have been boiling the chicken feet for 10 minutes and they are done. We will now turn off the flame and we'll wash them. We will now dry fry our white peppercorn. I have with me over here two tablespoons of white peppercorns. Just put them in. I'm using medium low heat now. We just need to fry this for approximately two to three minutes. Frying the peppercorns will bring out a better fragrance to it. Normally that's what I do. Now of course, if you do not have peppercorns at home, you can always use pepper powder, no problem at all. Once I've dry roasted this, I will crush them up using a mortar and a pestle so that the fragrance will be more enhanced. Once you can smell the aroma of the pepper, you can turn off the heat and we will proceed to crush our peppercorns. Now we'll prepare our stock. In a pot, add in two liters of water, the blanched chicken feet, put them all in. And in this muslin bag, I have crushed peppercorn as well as 50 grams of dried anchovies. Just put everything in. Put the lid on, turn the heat up to medium or medium high and we'll let this come to a boil. The water is boiling now. We'll turn the heat down to low and we'll let this simmer for 45 minutes. I'll see you back in a while. We'll now put the dish together. Heat up a pan, make sure it is hot. Add in a suitable amount of oil. Swirl the oil around a little bit. I'm using white snapper over here, cut in half. This is approximately 800 grams. You can use any snapper of your choice or even sea bass, no problem. We'll let this fry for about 2-3 minutes on each side. We'll move them around, we'll fry until the fish skin is set in place. I'm using medium heat right now. Well, let's just have a look to see whether it has brown. Be very careful when you turn it over. To ensure that your fish is not fishy after you cooked it, the important thing is of course to get a very fresh fish. Just a little bit of browning will be fine. Secondly is to remove any visible blood on the fish. All right, otherwise your fish will be really fishy. Continue to fry them for a few minutes. By frying the fish now, later when we add in the stock, the soup will become very milky. Now we'll add in 30 grams of young ginger, sliced thinly, the stem of a spring onion. Just add your stock in now. Do not turn down the heat. Still leave the heat at medium or medium high. We'll now add in our Beijing cabbage, 280 grams of this. Add in also 100 grams of shumeji mushroom. And also, one packet of silky tofu sliced. Put them in. Put the lid on. Turn the heat up to high. And we'll boil this for 10 minutes. I'll see you back in a while. I've been boiling the soup for about 10 minutes now. Let's have a look. Oh, wow, smells really good. We'll now add in our tomatoes. Two tomatoes, quartered. Just put them in. We'll need to season this. One teaspoon of sugar and salt to taste. I'll be adding in two teaspoons. Let's just give this a taste. Wow, very sweet, very, very good. Finally, to enhance the taste, I'm adding in one tablespoon of Chinese cooking wine. This is optional, add in if you like. A little bit of Chinese cooking wine taste. We'll just let this boil for another minute or so and then we'll have our lunch. So one minute is up, let's have our lunch now. Mm -hmm. 
And now the dish is done, let's have a taste. Try the cabbage. Mmm. Very soft. Very good. The mushroom. I'll try the soup now. The soup is really, really very fresh, very sweet, with a hint of pepper as well as ginger. Very good. Try the fish. Mmm. Very tender. So ladies and gentlemen, I hope you like our video. Do click like on our video and do subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.